Good morning. Today I'm going to quickly talk you through how to make a windowsill garden using vegetables and things that you might be using for your dinner. So here's one I started a week or two ago. We've added bits as we went along. We've got celery, parsnips, carrots, radish and aubergine and growing really well over here is a parsnip. So first of all, you'll need a chopping board. You'll need a sharp knife and an adult to help you use the sharp knife and the vegetables that you're going to use. Some we've already chopped off. We've got fennel, which we have chopped the end off there, and celery, which we've already chopped the end off as well. But all you need to do with your vegetables of choice is chop off the ends around two centimeters from the end, very carefully, chop them off. If you can there goes a parsnip and then do the same with the carrot you might want to use radishes you can experiment with all sorts of different vegetables then simply put the vegetable ends into your chosen dish here I've just got a dish that we'd use for cooking you can use something from the recycling absolutely anything put the vegetable tops into your dish if it's a carrot you need to have the little bit where the greenery will grow facing upwards Things like celery, you need to have the bits with the roots facing down. Here we've also got an onion. And as I say, we've got fennel, which is a really lovely vegetable, but quite unusual. Just arrange them neatly in your bowl and then pour in a small amount of water. No more than probably half a centimetre. That's it. When that's done, you can see the water in there. You just need to find a nice sunny windowsill, put it there, and then within a very short amount of time, just a couple of days, they will begin to grow. So here it is on our sunny windowsill, and hopefully within a couple of days, those carrot tops will begin to grow, and the celery will actually grow new celery sticks. So as you see here, this celery is actually growing new sticks. And you'll be able to eat those. The onions, when they grow, you'll be able to plant them. The parsnips, you could eat, but they taste absolutely yucky. But they're good for animals, for rabbits, for guinea pigs. The radish top grows beautifully. And the carrot tops, you can actually use in salads. You can eat those yourself, or if you've got animals, feed them to the animals. But it's really fun to see how, in just a few days, new vegetables will begin to grow. Hope you enjoy making one.